This is ANN News Brief. Good morning. I am Roti Mi at Kinsunde. DR Congo Health Ministry says medical workers have given all the immediate contact of Ebola patients in the city of Mbadaka an experimental vaccine as they try to contain the disease that has claimed at least 25 lives. A prison service official says at least 180 prisoners were at large after escaping from a jail in Mina during a raid on the facility. Gunmen had attacked a medium security prison there on Sunday evening. Interior Minister General Abdurrahman Dambazao said 30 inmates had been captured out of the 180 that fled. We'll be right back. sure you want to do this? Adam, go and bring us your husband. Okay, hello baby. We're in this together, okay? Can you hear me? Keep coming forward. Wait, 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 stop, stop. <laughs> you okay, Lily, to your right? <laughs> Keep walking now. Keep walking to the left. Yes. You're almost here. Keep going. You are here. <laughs> wow, you did it. I'm just so glad I didn't have to use my cane to do this. And I am so glad no other man got you before me. Let me be your eyes. We will never stop working to give you a network you can rely on so you can enjoy life's special moments. MTN, everywhere you go. The EU has called for respect for freedom of expression after an opposition-organized protest was dispersed by million security forces last weekend. After visiting the country last week, UN Secretary General Antonio Guterres said he is worried the situation could escalate. Mali's presidential elections are two months away. That's ANN News Brief. Join us again at the top of the hour. For more details, visit our website at annafrica.net. I am Rotimi Akinsunde.